Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. And uh, today I'm going, uh, I'm in the bus, as you can see, going back home. And uh, I'm going to tell you a little bit about um, how does the government uh, fight the corruption here in in, uh, in China, you know. So for a very long and until recently, uh, there always been a huge corruption in terms of uh, all the, um, the public market. So when you have a public market, let's say the government, the city of Changsha or the city of uh, Zhuzhou or any city in China or any province, they will ask uh, the companies to build a bridge. They will ask the companies to build a bro or the road. They will ask the company to build a, the, uh, the new uh, station, a new bus station. Okay, so this, they will have this public market. What would happen before is um, they would simply ask the company, give me your price. And they will look, they will look at the price, and they will select the company. Most of the times, they will select the companies that uh, will have the cheaper price. So if you are cheaper, um, the government will select you to build the road or to build the bridge. Of course, what would happen is the companies they were on purpose. They will um, they will put cheaper price, and then they will after that they will increase the price once once they get the market. So they will say, oh, I can build this bridge for uh, this price. Oh, it's very cheap. You get the market. Once they get the market, and they will increase the price. They say, oh, you need to, to pay this in more, and you need to pay that in more. So they will, they will do this. Another thing that they will do um, is, of course, they will bribe. They will bribe, so they will bribe this guy and that guy. And then uh, they will maybe, in uh, even they are not so cheap, the government will select this specific company. And then part of the money that they get paid, in fact, they will give it back under the table to uh, to some government officials. So this happened uh, all the time, and this happened still happen today, unfortunately. And uh, all of China is made of this. So all the roads, maybe 60, 70 percent of the roads were were built this way. All most of the buildings, and that's why when you are around in China, except for the huge project for the very high tech projects such as the and uh, mo most of the places like this, the the road, the bridge, the new buildings, the everything, even the fast train. You see in China, the fast train, it used to to go as fast as uh, 400 km per hour. And now the government, uh, because you have had a few accidents and the government say, oh, it's not safe. And why it's not safe? Because it was not built well. And then they, now they say it's better to reduce the speed and go uh, have the train go uh, more slowly because otherwise it's not safe you know there is no safety and why it's not safe because of course there was some corruption and uh, they didn't build it well but anyway uh, now the government did some improvements so now what they do is when you have a public offer like this uh, they will set they will set the price so will say we need to build a bridge here and the price is 100 or the price is 150 and that's the price we don't look at the price we don't ask you to make it cheaper or more expensive the price is set that's the price you get your commission on that price and and after that how they will how they will select which company gets the market they will just um do it by luck so there will be company one company two company three company four five six seven eight nine okay and they will pick up one number and they will say okay it's uh, the fate decide. Let's the fate decide. So for this market to build the bridge, it will be a uh, company number four who, uh, who gets the market. Oh, who is company number four? Oh, that's uh, maybe a uh, Zoomlun. That's Zoomlun. That's the big company Zoomlun. So they want. They are not going to select a specific company. They will just pick up the company just uh, like this. Uh, let let the chance decide. Let the fate decide. So the hazard, hazard. You know. Let's, uh, so that's how they do it. So you are now you are you might tell me oh that's great so thanks to this there is no more um, no more corruption in China on this uh, public market but unfortunately that's not the case because you see there are always ways to to go around now the corruption is not doesn't before the corruption w would happen when you had to select the market so you would have the, this public market and in order to select the company who gets the market there will be some corruption so be the company will pay some officials or you know that's that's how it, it would be. And I need to get outside of the bus. But now the the corruption hap happens after. The corruption happens after. So what will happen is um, the company. Let's say, uh, for instance, uh, I get the chance to get the market to build the road uh, for uh, Hunan Province. Okay. So I will just um, tell uh, some official. Okay. Thank you for the market. I get the market. Okay. And uh, I was very lucky. I got this market. And now um, what I'm going to do is I will build. I will put less cement. 
I will put uh, instead of putting 10 millimeter or 10 centimeter of cement I will only put three you know I will only put three centimeters of cement nobody will see the difference nobody will see the difference in the short run nobody will see that the road quality is not good I build the road you ask me to build the road I build the road except Normally the safety standard for a high quality road is 10 centimeter of cement. I will only put three centimeters of cement, you know? And of course I will save a lot of money this way and all the money that I save, I will give you part of it and I will keep part of it for myself. So that's how now the corruption happens in China. And this can be like this for many, many things. So in the end you have buildings that are not built well, you have a bridge that are not built well, you have roads that, that are ugly after a few years of use. And this is how it, it used to, it's, it's now. Before it used to be for the selection of the public market, you have corruption before. And but now uh, they improved a lot on this part, but they cannot do uh, for everything. So there will still be corruption, but uh, you see uh, it happens after. So that's what I want to tell you today. And I'm uh, coming back. Uh, <laughs> I'm going back home. So I will leave you for now and I will talk to you soon. Take care, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to follow the channel to give me your support. I need your support and uh, you need to support my work, okay? <laughs> Take care everyone.